Oh, is this a light bright thing? Can this you... is Lightzilla. Oh, this is awesome. We should play with this for a sec. Is your instinct with these to make order or chaos? Yes. <laughs> Hey everybody, so uh, today I'm announcing a brand new partnership with a company that I had heard of before but didn't really know anything about until relatively recently. And that company is Zappos. You might know of them. They're an online retailer. They sell shoes and clothes and stuff like that. What you might not know and what I didn't know is how forward thinking they are about their company culture, their core values, just how they do what they do. Another thing you might not know about Zappos is that they are really big on supporting artwork and creativity. They put a lot into revitalizing downtown Las Vegas, the neighborhood where they're headquartered with all kinds of huge murals and sculptures and stuff. They do a lot with local artists. They're also supporters of the Life is Beautiful Music and Art Festival. And now, Zappos wants to support a bunch of creative projects on Hit Record. Oh, oh my god! Shit! I know it's sort of an unlikely partnership in a way, and uh, it's a funny story how it came about. So uh, I wanted Tony, Tony Shea, the CEO of the company, to be able to tell you the story. And so I recently went out to Las Vegas where they're headquartered and brought some cameras and we had a conversation and it went like this. Do you want to talk about how you found out about Hit Record? Yeah, how we stalked you, basically. <laughs> yeah. There's this coffee shop around the corner, and we were sitting at a small table where there was a bookshelf next to us, and I happened to pick one up, and it was called The Tiny Book of Tiny Stories. Mm -hmm. And I was like, oh, that's cool. And what was supposed to originally be like a one-hour brunch together, I think we were there for three hours because we just went through every single page, and we're taking turns reading each page out loud and showing the pictures and so on and by the end I was like who wrote this I had never heard of hit record before and basically spent the rest of the day playing around with the website reading all about hit record and I was like let's try to meet them Tony was inspired with how the tiny book of tiny stories was made collaboratively by people from all over the world so he and his team met with us in person at the hit record office we brainstormed a bunch of ideas we came up with a ton and we decided to do pretty much all of them yeah so here are some of the projects Zappos is going to be supporting throughout the summer and fall of this year. We're going to make a mixtape and invite people to collaborate on seven original songs. We want to figure out how to make art out of shoeboxes, cardboard, dioramas, things like that. And then just tons of visual art, collaborative paintings, illustrations, photography, collage, etc. We're going to make a series of short documentaries, one for each of the Zappos 10 core values, which is a huge part of their company culture. Most of the values don't seem necessarily like business things. They seem just kind of like good ways to be a human. Well, it's kind of the same thing, I mean. Every business is made up of humans. Although I think people forget that. One of the Zappos core values is to create fun and a little weirdness. <laughs> so we're gonna be making a whole series of videos whose only mandate is that they need to be weird. Ah, you're in the video. When these projects get finished, we're gonna celebrate them in a number of ways. Of course, we'll do it on the Hit Record platform. Some of the stuff we make, we'll post to our larger social media audiences. Some of the music will go on Spotify or iTunes. And Zappos will amplify all of that celebration by sharing the art on their platform, on their social channels, etc. And hopefully letting the world see what kind of kooky creative folks Zapponians really are. We're launching a ton of these new projects today. Come check them out and we'll be launching more over the coming weeks and months. And as with all partnerships that Hit Record has ever done with brands. When one of our productions makes money, the contributing artists get paid. We've made a video specifically about payment for this production. You can check that out too if you want. We also so... just have to point out, you're wearing a Hit Record t-shirt. Yeah. Yeah. We did not plan this. We did not. <laughs> we did. No, that was totally lucky. <laughs> I love the shirt. Whoever, props to whoever made this. So um, yeah, feels really good to be partnering with Zappos, with Tony, to be doing something with a partner that clearly really understands what we're doing, why we're doing it. Feels really nice. You know, the chances that you, in the real world, would know all the perfect people for a specific project is pretty low, unless you're... In Hollywood. You. Yeah, yeah. Um, but for the rest of the world, it's just amazing that they can all come together from all the different corners of the world and still do amazing things. Well, this partnership is going to mean that a lot of people get to 
do a lot more of those creative things and get to do it together. On behalf of that community, I just want to say thank you to, to you and Zappos for, for you know, lending that support. Excited. Yeah. Should we do a motorcycle hug? Motorcycle hug. Okay. <laughs> no, you can't get up. That's the whole...